Hi YouTube, it's me again. I just wanted to make a video on this hairstyle that I just tried out. I think it's cute. Um, it's just a ponytail and in the front I braided my bangs. I just wanted to see how long my bangs got and I am so happy about the length of my bangs. Um, I have a funny hairline, so my hair grows like all the way out here. And then right here, it doesn't really grow. So it's just like, this is my forehead. But anyways, I just wanted to come on here and show you guys my hair and how much it has grown. I love being natural. I've been natural now for about a year and two months. And no regrets. And I um, hope you like, rate, comment, and um, subscribe. Thank you to all my new subscribers. I love you guys. Thank you to the natural community out there. I cannot wait to come back from this deployment and show you guys how much my hair has grown. This is a year, YouTube. This is a year. When I first cut my hair, I had like barely half an inch. So this is the hair. Hope you can see it. And like I said, there's nothing wrong with being natural. As long as you're comfortable with yourself and you have enough confidence to know that regardless of what kind of hair is on your head, you're still beautiful, being natural will be easy. That journey is not hard. You just have to be a strong person. Um, people are always going to have opinions. People are always going to comment. People are always going to be like, oh, I like your hair better like this, with braids or whatever, with weave. doesn't matter. Whatever it is that you're comfortable with, wear it. And to all the females that are natural, that are in the military, I understand how hard it is as far as being in uniform and people always trying to say, oh, your hair is not in regulation. I read the regs and I know exactly what it is that we're allowed to have in our hair. I, at some point, I had um, went to WLC, which is like a training that you go to to either become a sergeant or to make you a better sergeant. And this sergeant was like, E6 type, was like, oh, why do you have that headband on your hair? That's not a regulation. And I told him that it was, so I pulled up the rags and I showed it to him, and he was like, oh, wow, you know, you know your stuff, you know your stuff. But being a sergeant in the military, I am proud of my hair. I am proud to be natural. I am not embarrassed by it. People always, like on Friday when I went to work, they were like, um, some guy was singing the song, Rough and tough in my ass for puff or whatever. I don't know. I don't know how it goes. But and then people are like, oh wow, is that your hair? Can I touch your puff? Can I touch it? And I just think it's funny how people react to it. And I just enjoy it. And negative comments, laughs, giggles, bad stares, it does not bother me. Because I did this for me. I cut my hair for me. I wanted to go natural for me. I did not want to put chemicals in my hair. I got tired of my hair being full warm in it, the next minute being um, real thin, so I just embrace what God gave me, so just be confident, ladies, just be proud that you're beautiful, and just know that regardless of what anybody thinks, that God made you in his image, and I'm sorry, God is not ugly, or, you know, so, you're beautiful, be strong, hold your head up high, and even though you might not be comfortable with your hair, as long as you have this persona, and you show on the outside that you are comfortable, People will really, like, people can sense that and they don't really bother you too much. So as long as you walk with your head tall and proud, people will not bother you, I promise you. And if they do, just ignore them, haters, shake them off. Anyways, you two, thank you to all my new subscribers again. Thank you to everybody out there with videos. And I just wanted to come out here and show you guys my hair. Like my earrings. Doing the little, you know, vibe, Nubian vibe. Anyways, this is Nubian Princess coming to you guys again. Stay blessed. Bye, YouTube.